Hey G Squad, welcome back to another episode of Is It Worth It? So today's episode with this cool, amazing product right here in my hand, if you can see, basically what this is is an Apple Watch case. And for this case, it actually is pretty cool because it has a built-in glass screen protector. So that way you guys don't need to put it on yourself. All you guys need to do is just put it on this case and you guys are all set. So first thing first, let me actually open up the product to show you guys what the product actually looks like and what comes out the package first. Alright, so when you open it up, First day as you can see is the actual case itself. So inside it looks like they provide us a user manual to teach you guys how to use it. And inside here, they provide you guys the actual cloth itself that you can actually use to wipe off the glass screen protector itself on the actual case whenever you guys need to. That's pretty cool. And all the instructions are here as well, if you can see. So obviously when you guys apply the case itself, you guys wanna make sure you guys use the cloth to wipe it down. Maybe you guys want to use like alcohol wipes or whatever, you definitely can as well. But all they provide for you guys here is the cloth. And that's basically everything that's in the packaging itself. Now let's take a look at the actual case now. So this is basically what the case looks like and see. It's not really too flexible, but there is the glass screen protector right here. And then this is what the inside looks like right here. So the way how they built the case itself is pretty nice. All you guys need to do is just snap it on. And they do have the opening on the sides as well for the case so right there. And also on this side as well, as you can see. For the button so the one that i have right here is for the 42 millimeter uh case for the actual apple watch itself there are different sizes so it depends on which one you guys have that's how you guys determine which one to get so first thing i want to do is to use the little cloth to wipe it off like this make sure it's all clean before we apply it on and then what you guys want to do now is to peel off this piece of paper that they have right here and then apply it on so just like that and all you guys need to do now is just snap it on so you guys want to make sure it fits the correct side. So this side where the buttons are should fit right here. So you guys want to put that side first and then snap it in. Just like that. And it's all set. You guys can see. So this is basically what it looks like once you guys put it on. So obviously the button controls works fine because it sticks out right here. So that part's not protected. But the screen itself is protected. So this is basically what the overall product looks like once you guys apply it on. From each side right there. Bottom and top. And in the middle. Center. When you guys actually use the Apple Watch itself, it's actually pretty easy to use it. It doesn't really get affected, especially when you guys use the touch controls on here. You guys can see, it's really, really smooth. So because of this product itself, it's not only just a case, it has a built-in glass screen protector. So that means it can be protected from like scratches, uh, dent, uh, from dirt or whatever. Even if you guys do end up dropping it on the corners or on the front side, it is well protected, which is pretty awesome. And the fact that it's so minimal is even more cool as you see. And the way how they designed these cases is the fact that it's so easy to kind of like apply it on and so easy to remove it. So when you guys want to just remove it, just pull it out like this and it's all set. And when you guys want to put it back on, just snap it back in place like that. Very insane. Very cool and very easy to use. And just like you guys hear whether or not it's actually real glass, you guys can tell right here. So now that we do unboxing and testing on product itself, now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. So for me, honestly, I would definitely have to say that any case that has a glass screen protector that's built onto it makes it that much more worth it than like a regular case for your uh, Apple Watch itself. Because you guys get double the protection for the actual Apple Watch on the corners and in the middle. So that way, if you guys do end up cracking like the actual Apple Watch itself or scratching it by accident, you guys don't have to worry about it. But then obviously for those of you guys who don't want one or don't need one or have need one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that you do need. But other than that, that's pretty much it for quick unboxing and testing on the product itself. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, then make sure to subscribe, like, and comment down below. And if you guys like this video and you guys want to see more, then make sure to click on that bell notification in the bottom to be notified of new videos that will be coming up in the future. But as always, make sure to stay positive. Be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace. And then for today's G Squad fan shout day, we have.